Spain in the summer of 1936 was to ignite the fuse of war. It began as a rebellion among army officers against the newly elected Spanish government, a government intent upon socialist reforms. Violence spread like wildfire through the nation, polarizing the populace and the loyalists who were supported by the Soviet Union and Spanish fascists whose leader, Francisco Franco, was an admirer of Hitler and Mussolini. To aid Franco, Hitler and Mussolini sent seasoned troops, while the loyalists armed the civilians for what was to be the most bloody episode in the 1,000-year history of Spain. Aided by American volunteers and others, the Loyalists fought for almost three years against overwhelming odds. While Germany and Italy used the war as a test of their fighting machines, Britain and France, to contain the conflict, blockaded the Spanish ports, cutting off the Loyalist lines of supply. The war soon spread to the streets of Madrid, engulfing thousands of Spaniards in brutal block-to-block combat. With the Germans and Italians backing them up, the fascists mopped up the last of the loyalists, delivering the Spanish Republic to Franco. The cost to the nation was crippling. Broken in body and spirit, the people of Spain claimed their dead and lamented their losses, while the new Spanish state paraded its might through war-weary Madrid and toasted Europe's newest dictator. <laughs> 